The Disney Wish has begun refueling operations. At this time, we request that there be no open lights, flames, or smoking on the open decks. Once again, the Good morning from Castaway Key, where they are doing some refueling operations, or I guess we're done with that. But they're cleaning the boat. We're on port side today. Oh, that's bright. This is our second time on the Disney Wish, and the first time we were on Starboard, where you get a great view of Castaway Key as you pull up Disney's private island in the Bahamas. This time we are on the port side, so we have a bit of a different view, where we can see them working on the ship. There's like tractors doing stuff and cleaning, and they were refueling this morning and all of that. So it's interesting to get both views, but we're about to go down to the island, soak up the sun, get some beach time, get away from all this going on, and go have a lovely, relaxing day on the beach. So let's go. Gotta go all the way down to get off the ship. Today, we have to be back all aboard at 4.45. All right. And we're getting off the ship, and that's what's going on over there on our side of the ship. Wow. They really take care of this ship, don't they? And this is a view of the ship. Beautiful, and we're gonna walk out to the beach. Daisy's out, how cute! We love to look at the ship when you get off. You can see Rapunzel and the crystal clear, beautiful water. Welcome to Castaway Key. You could say K if you want to. Look at that beauty. Look at that sparkling crystal clear blue water. Vinnie! Look how cool, you can get these little bikes and ride through the water. The water is so beautiful today. Now we're walking, but you can also take this ferry or shuttle. It's not a ferry, it's a shuttle. <laughs> And they'll take you out to different parts of the beach. There are many different beaches here at Castaway. And they're all nice. Now Disney said that Castaway Key would be decorated for the silver anniversary too, the 25th anniversary of Disney Cruise Line. So far we haven't seen anything. Uh, I bet it'll be decorated like the day after we leave. <laughs> right? Yeah. That's just... Try the Christmas one. Yeah. What a nice ride you've got here. He's riding in style and the outfit. Oh my God. So I guess this new paint job on Mount Rushmore is part of the silver 25th anniversary. It's painted this beautiful aqua color like the shimmering seas with the sparkles on it. It's subtle, but it's something. And here on Castaway, they have lunch and they have beverages and everything is included. Well, there are things you can buy extra, but Almost everything's included. Castaway is definitely more crowded this time than it has been the previous two times we were here, but there's plenty of room in the water. All right, it's beach time. Let's walk out on the white sand to the water. It's very cold. It's always really cold at first though. Oh gosh, it's really cold. Oh, it usually warms up though. Definitely cold at first, and you know, you get used to it little by little. Oh, a little extra seaweed today. It's just spice, it's just ocean peppers. Just slowly getting used to the water. Slowly. It's so cool to see the ship out there, though. There are two snorkeling areas, I think. This one's just kind of like free snorkeling. And then the other snorkeling area, you can see cool things under the water. We did that the first time we came out, and it was really fun. Ooh, how's that? You getting used to it? Okay. I think you're getting Floridian blood. Oh. That's what I think. <laughs> I just heard the lifeguard make an announcement. I couldn't tell what he was saying. But if y'all remember the first time we were here and they made an announcement telling everyone to get out of the water and then we had those like water funnels, those like water tornadoes and the weather got absolutely bonkers. But today it looks good. So hopefully that will not happen. 
I think it was that people were climbing on the rocks and they were like, don't climb on the rocks, you silly people. Don't climb on the rocks. Oh. He's saying everyone in the snorkel area has to have on their snorkel vest and life jacket. So just so you know, you can be on this side and swim freely, but if you're on that side, you have to have your snorkeling gear on. They have separate areas, but look, we're so close to it. But I won't go over there. I don't want to get scolded. Like a mermaid. are always good. Hearing people playing and laughing and having fun. We're seeing fish now, really cool fish, some bigger fish. They're so silvery that you can barely see them. They camouflage perfectly, but every once in a while we're catching glimpses. And because my hands are wet, I keep accidentally putting the camera into like time-lapse mode. So hopefully some of my good fish footage comes out because this is, this is some good fish stuff. Not fishing, just fish viewing. <laughs> It is now lunchtime. There are also some shops on the island with a lot of cute merchandise. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is the 5K stuff. So if you do the 5K on the island, that's cute. Here's where the 5K starts. And the bike rentals, too. Yeah, cookies, too. Lunch is served from 11.30 to 2. It's about 12.30 now, and it's a madhouse, but that's okay. Yeah, ice cream here. It's all included. Get chocolate, vanilla, vanilla. Mm. Ooh, nice soft serve. There's cookies, there's cookies too, and then there's another place, multiple places to get basically the same food. Yummy, yummy. Oh my gosh, I love everything. We got burgers, hot dogs, Cajun spice rotisserie, chicken, BBQ, spare ribs, honey and bourbon glaze, salmon. Just oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh yeah. I see you. Here's a little look at the map of Castaway and the many, many things to do. The 5K, the bike route, the snorkeling, the swimming. There's a ship over there different Disney ships come here and it's just lovely. They also provide free life vests for the little ones. Oh, such a nice day. Let's have a little look in one of the merch shops. She sells Nazi shells and everything else. Towels.
now that we've had lunch, we are gonna pick an activity to do, and I think we're gonna do the aqua trike. So come along with us. And over there, you can swim with stingrays. I see them. Wow. Need a life jacket for this. It is required. Let's see, will this fit me? Sam. Yes. Are you ready to aqua trike? I am ready. <laughs> me? Too. We were looking at this from the boat. We even said it before yeah. we headed out on the cruise, right? We were like, maybe we'll aqua trike this time. Work off some cookies. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. So we get to, like, there's buoys showing us where to go and. Ow, shell. So 20 feet away. Yeah. You can go quite far, though. Yeah, you can go really far. Woo! Thank you. Okay, back. Back. There you go. <laughs> this is yeah. kind of fun. Yeah. That's kind around. of neat. Okay, you gotta turn us around. Sam, you're in charge of a uh, directional link. Alright. Okay, let's go forward already. Okay, here we go. Oh, Give me that clunk. Yeah. Clunk. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow, there's a lot of bounce, isn't there? This yeah. is so cool. So fun. Alright. Alright. That's pretty fun. Take us over that way. Alright. The ship, that's cool. Yeah, there's a ton of aqua trikes. Oh, yeah, come out, yeah, the aqua mouse is running. Get yeah, a little red. We applied my sunscreen, but still. Look how beautiful the water is. You're the captain. Yeah, I'm the captain. I'm the captain Minnie and you're Captain Minnie. That's a nice spot. Yeah, this is really nice. Hey. It's so cool being out here. Pedaling? Yeah, I'm pedaling up a storm over here. You no, pedaling? No slacking. No. I could have gotten a smaller size of this. It's kind of like sticking up, but you know. I'm slacking a little, Sam. I wish I could jump in the water, but this is like a no swimming area for yeah. some reason. It's not very deep. It's not. It's, it's more clear and beautiful than the other part. This would be a cool place to paddle board to learn how to learn. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, because it's not scary. I've never done that. I've never paddle boarded either. A kayak, I've done almost everything. I've never done paddle boarding. You don't have to pedal too hard. Yeah, I think we started off yeah. pedaling really hard. Now I'm like, oh, we can go yeah. a little leisurely. But you're not like working out on a bike. It's yeah. So yeah. Hi. <laughs> this is really fun. Oh, oh Tom's coming in handy. Oh, yeah. look at that. Wow. Hopefully this like works. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. This is great. Highly nice. recommend. Yeah. yeah. I had no idea how nice this would be. Yeah. I love it. I love it. It was $28 for two people for half an hour. Yeah, we'll go all the way around and like come back. And they did say since they don't have a ton of people aqua triking, if we went a little over half an hour, it wouldn't be a big deal today. And you can book these in advance, but we just got it on the fly. So clear. This is nuts. It's like beautiful for the dog. Yeah. It's beautiful. I'd like to stop and have a look around. Yeah. What movie's on? Uh, let's see. Oh, a way to watch a movie. Yeah. We'll watch Funnel Vision premiere. I see an animal. I think it's Lion King? What? Yeah. yeah. It's Lion King.
Pro malfunction. Hopefully, all the footage is still good. <laughs> if not, the memories not, are. Here we go. We start over. The memories are good. <laughs> this is nice. Okay. It does look amazing. I feel like I can stand up. Yeah, absolutely. It's so shallow. Crystal clear blue water, you see it. This is amazing. It's like, like a bomb, rather than like an ocean. Yeah, like a pool. Yeah. It's nice and leisurely. No, you can go as fast or slow as you want. against the current yeah. and the waves. If it was just smooth. Uh-oh. Okay. So he's got that stick that moves the sail. Come on, guys. Okay. Here we go. We're almost there. And we're almost there. And we're almost there. You can come in. Make way. Make way. fun we had an amazing time and now we are gonna head back onto the ship get showered get changed and get ready for tonight's festivities Aladdin Aladdin World of Marvel and all the other fin last night <sighs> today could not have been more perfect and relaxing just straight up vacation mode oh, yeah. yeah it does smell so good is kind of cool. Oh yeah, Captain Bob Iger. We're seeing like a bunch of the crew getting back on board. There are some crew that live on this island or stay on the island and then there's some that get on and off. Look, like they're still doing like cleaning or whatever with the crane. And when you're getting back on, they give you cold towels and you get orange water, cucumber water, lemon water. I got some orange water. And here is the view from our room on port side. And they're still doing like cleaning and stuff out here. <laughs> they tend to the ship, take care of it. And now it's time to shower and get freshened up. We had the best day at Castaway Key. Just the perfect mix of relaxation, excitement, activity, sun, fun, salt water, just breathing in the sea air. It's so, so nice. That's a lot of S's. And now we're back in the room. We showered, we got all refreshed. It's such a nice feeling after a beach day to like just shower and get fresh again. And we're gonna go out for the last night of this sailing <laughs> so let's go out there and enjoy the final evening of this disney wish silver sailing cruise i love it 
I love the designs in the carpet. It's characters galore right now and there's sailor costumes, there's princesses out. This is great. Mickey's so nice spiffy. Mickey. Yeah. Hi, Captain Mickey. Hello there. You look so spiffy. I saw you dusting off. Looking so good. Always captaining the ship. It's been a smooth sailing, I gotta say. You've been amazing. <laughs> and Cinderella. We went all the way around here. Yeah? Mm. yeah, we went all the way out. Mm. And we're taking off, we're sailing away. Right? We are moving, right? Yeah. We're moving. Beautiful. Bye, Castaway. See you next time. We're casting away. I love you both. And the other fairy tale players. Yeah, the Brad's Hall. How's everyone doing this evening? Great! Thank you for the fun of the show beignet from the bayou one of our favorite places on board great show so much fun lots of confetti little bursts of the genie Everything, the only thing that was missing was a boo. Gotta get our picture with the lamp. Yeah, our same spot. We love Nightingales. Here we go. We popped back into Nightingales because we love the vibe in here and we got the Jubilee by the Sea, the 25th anniversary drink. And it looks beautiful. And it's just so nice in here. Nightingales is actually an adult only lounge. It's the only adult only lounge on the ship besides the adult only area. The other lounges become adult only after. I know I talked about this already, but Nightingales is based on the scene in Cinderella where she's singing Sing Sweet Nightingale, and so are the stepsisters. A beautiful scene, a beautifully animated scene, and these tapestries are incredible. Yeah, let's have a look. The sunset tonight is exquisite. I'm not ready for this to be the last night of the cruise. <sighs> look how fast it seems like we're going. And the moon glowing on the water. Feels unreal. Tonight for dinner we have Worlds of Marvel. And this is a fun one with Ant-Man and the Wasp. Our mission is to inspire the next generation of heroes. The five demonstrations of exciting new technologies. Thank you. I shared this dining experience in great detail in my last Disney Wish series. So if you want to see like every single thing, check that out. Tonight I'm going to share some highlights with you and some of the coolest parts. But maybe not every single thing because it's a lot. It's a big long dinner with a show and a whole thing. But I'll show you the very coolest parts. Avengers everywhere. Have you a look at the menu. I like that it's a marble loaf 
Like Marvel, Marble? <laughs> you know what? I need to breathe, find my chi. I just need 15 minutes to. Hi, I'm Scott Lang. Um, but you might know me as Ant Man. Ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Pretty sweet, right? Yeah. Lots of crumbs on your tables. Ready to go? Yeah. Three, two. Oh. One. Uh oh. Uh, that didn't work. Sam, what happened? Uh, I don't know if I missed it early by accident. I think it was me and Candace. Honest. Honey, you shrunk the ship. Uh, <laughs> uh, I <laughs> We fixed it. Oh, of course, me and Candace are Scott, what's going on? Oh, nothing, not. It's a, I, hypothetical, just making conversation. Scott? Uh, thanks, you're the best. Scott! Warning! Shield barrier failure imminent. Right, you boy. It's hero time. When I give the signal, smash your buttons. If I don't make it back, avenge me. Target acquired. Hit your buttons now! <laughs> This is not, Spider-Man did not come last time we were here, so this is something new. Splendid idea. Shall I play the victory playlist? Yes, yes. Sir, hit it. Oh, that was the fastest Spider-Man ever. Looks like he's spending more time with this side of the restaurant. So interesting, last time we dined here, Ant-Man and the Wasp came out and high-fived and fist-bumped everybody. They had a bunch of jokes. They were really funny. It was awesome. This time, Spider-Man came out instead. I thought maybe he was coming out in addition to, but they switched, so it's not Ant-Man the Wasp, it's Spider-Man now. So I wonder if they'll be switching characters, or I don't know what's going on with that. But also last time, the servers came out at the end, and they had a bunch of jokes about like uh, shrinking and enlarging desserts, and I think they had like a giant pretzel, and a giant like Mickey bar, or something like that. Whatever it was, it was very funny, and they did not do that this time. So it shows they're kind of changing some of the things that they do, which is interesting. They can't change much of what's on the screen, but they can change what happens in the restaurant. So I guess in a way that's good because if you come back again, you may have different characters and experiences. Now there's one more important thing to do, and that's the final wish of the trip. So I got my wishing wand, and we're gonna go do it. There are so many beautiful details on this ship.
I love your silver outfit. You look spectacular as always. This is the final opportunity to meet a bunch of characters. They're in their silver 25th anniversary outfits. Well, some of them are. Some, like the princesses, are in their regular outfits. And it's just a really good time. And everybody is out for one more wish tonight. Nobody wants to say goodbye. Nobody does, right? Not me. I don't want to. Good night, Disney Wish. Thank you for a fantastic voyage. Wishes do come true. Final towel animal of the cruise. Oh, looks like a big lobster. It's so cool. I love getting these every night. Mm. Oh wow, look at that. And I'm back on the veranda of our stateroom and that wraps up this leg of this month's travel. And that wraps up this video series for our cruise on the Disney Wish celebrating Disney Cruise Line's 25th anniversary. This was the first ever silver sailings, silver at sea celebration, and they'll be going on throughout the summer, and select sailings will have different offerings, but this was the very first one, so I'm glad this somehow worked out and we got to do this and see some of what's on offer. There were a lot of little special things, just kind of, I'd say it's like an overlay, like some silvery special anniversary stuff. Loved the character costumes, especially Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Daisy, Chippendale, and Goofy, and Pluto. They all had special costumes. I kind of think that was my favorite part. I did like the soiree. It was just like a little cute thing they did with the free drinks and all of that. And for, you know, like I said, for cruisers on later in the summer, you should hopefully see Castaway Key decorated as well. And also select sailings will get the second set of fireworks. So much alliteration always. But even without the silver stuff, it's just wonderful to be on a Disney cruise. One thing we used to think was that Disney cruise was meant more for families and young kids. And it definitely is. There's so much for families and people of all ages. But there's also so much for adults. And we've seen pretty often that like kids love the kids clubs and they can go there and then the adults can go to adult things, they can do family things together and then everyone can do their own things. There's quite a mix of things. There's so much to do at any given time. You can look in the navigator in the app and on the schedule and there's just a ton going on. So, so much. So you can choose to do as much or as little as you want just get into vacation mode and chill and have fun we have seen families and people of all ages multi-generational families and a lot of couples too like adults and friend groups having fun that just love disney and love disney in their hearts and love cruising being out on the ocean and it's just a wonderful time so i hope throughout these video series where i'm doing disney cruises i show you a lot that there is to do for everybody for families kids, adults, everyone of all ages, and also for adults, because we have found a lot. Like there's adult only areas, 
on the ship too, but even everything, like the characters, everything. It's all for everybody. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out with us for this cruise series. I hope you enjoyed every single day because we did different things and saw different things. We're actually gonna sit out here on the veranda and just be quiet and listen to the waves. Can you hear them? And just feel the ocean breeze and get ready for bed. And then yeah, again, it's more travel. So thank you so much for hanging out with us. I appreciate you all so much being here, your feedback, your comments, all of it. It's a lovely, wonderful community and y'all are awesome. Let me know your thoughts on our cruise, what your favorite parts were, and if you have a Disney cruise coming up and what you're most looking forward to. So I'm sending you a ton of love. I'll see you for the next video. But until then, as always, stay enthused. Bye.